Right, so so better time. Woohoo. <laughs> um But yeah. This is literally just I'm hoping this can be it. We just can't have shit catches. Basically what I've discovered is that the main game, the better it is. The better it is, the more attempts we can have at catches. But the worse it is, then the shittier catches. I didn't... Just wanted to do that beforehand. But yeah, this is a layout that I'm... Okay, I, I like to make layouts. <coughs> I like to make life split and... OBS layouts, uh, Twitch layouts. However, I can never find one that I like. And yeah, we're trying this one now because fuck it, why not? Yeah, we can be like 104 coming out of Suicune. And we would be on PB pace. Because technically, I lost all of my GST PB splits when. Um. When my internet died yesterday in the duo effect, though. So we're running with the 80848 splits, which are significantly better than the duo vector GST splits. But something I don't know if I cleared up um, was today I'm doing GST. Next week, then I'm transferring. I'm trying. I'm gonna try and get all of my lost splits. Like I'm gonna literally watch a 20-hour run. Um, slot in all of my splits, hopefully. If that doesn't work, then I'm just going to slot in my mochi splits. Then I'm going to do mochi practice. Then hopefully on the weekend coming up, so next weekend, um, I'll be doing hopefully a mochi run on one of those days. And then I'll do more cleanup practice, so like maybe movement cleanups. Um, maybe if I'm literally forgetting where one item is in Mochi, uh, I'll pick that up. Um, I'll literally just do some cleanup. Then I'll plan on time. Because <coughs> the problem with planning on time for the Duo Effector the first time was... Um, I don't have, I didn't have a time in Mochi, so I couldn't put an estimate in. But now I can put an estimate. In. And it would be about 12 hours. If I were to do one right now, it would probably be about 12 and 8.30. Though I don't want to do one right now because I'm not, I'm not sure I'm capable of getting an 808 again. Like, I just don't think it's going to happen. But yeah, this was two days ago we did this. In the Discord, Gal was calling me once again insane because I just come off of a 20 hour run and I'm already hopping into another 8 hour run. And this is the run that I do RTA. Like, I do GST RTA. Whereas Mochi, I would do break in between. Um, but I'm not sure if I want to uh, stream the practice. I don't know how much people would care. But 
But essentially, this is going to be a no reset. If I can get Suicune, we're running with Suicune. No matter how far behind we are. <coughs> and we're just going to finish the run. If I get Suicune, we're running Suicune. End of story. No, no questions asked. There's a chance I might be able to get two attempts in today. I'll just be finishing later. Oh, I didn't put that I was streaming anyway. Shit. I can do that real quick. Oh, isn't that Jalife? Isn't he streaming? I would check, but I've got so much fucking dialogue to mash through. Inazuma 11. I don't know what that is. But I wish luck. Shay, sure, right, we can shut the Twitter real quick. Fuck yeah, dude. GST for sub 8 for fucking. Because it's not fun. <laughs> Do it during this next fight. Something that I've started to learn for this run um, is not ever getting attached. Ever. Like, just don't. Don't get attached. If you don't get attached, then you won't be disappointed. I have a rule in this run of don't get attached until you're at the end. Finish the run and then you can be attached. Or well, technically to like after the Reggies. If you're done with all the catches... If you're done with all the catches... And you're ahead, then then you can stop being attached. But that means not being attached for like six and a half hours. Which to be honest, I never am. <clears throat> I just play like emotionally brain dead for six and a half hours. And then sometimes get attached. It's 
quite fun not getting attached to a run. This that could be really, really good. Feels kind of nice though to do a GST and not think I got mochi mayhem after this. As fun as that run was, I was kind of dreading towards the end of GST that I have to do a blind mochi run, or a semi-blind mochi run. But overall, that whole run went brilliant. I was like two and a half hours ahead. I got two... Uh, I got an hour and 50 minutes ahead of what I was expecting. It was a 12.10 or 12.20. And the goal was 14. They're not saying that the run was any good. Because the run was shit. Like, it was... An hour and a half slower than Crisis. Now, get it, Crisis has done runs. But, like, I... Uh, mm. Sub-12 is where it's at. If I can get a sub-12 uh, estimate, that'd be nice. I'll be ready then, because then I don't have to split the run into two videos. Because YouTube only accepts 12-hour VODs. Which is the problem with... Um, what's it called? With the Duo Effector, because I have to upload two parts. Technically three, because my recording got interrupted midway through. Um, in fact, I think it was like the pinnacle of Mochi. Like, I think it was dead center. Because the run was 620, so 610 would be halfway. The one thing that I don't think is healthy for this run. Oh, thanks for the good luck, gal. Um, one thing that I don't think is healthy is that until I get Suicune, I don't think that I'm playing for eight hours. Thing is, though, gal, this is just a normal day on the job. <laughs> I do this run anyway. Even though I did one two days ago and just come off of playing for 20 hours. I played Pokemon for 20 hours in the last 32 I come off of 10 hours sleep and played for 20. Um, I was in the multi-Pokemon Discord and they said that it could be verifiable depending on how long the the cut was. 8 hour run being normal is crazy? What, really? This is like the, the main thing, if the only thing that I stream. I mean, I get it. People don't have the mental fucking stamina as I said yesterday that I do to do these runs, but this just seems normal. But I have motivation again, because, again, that duo effector run was shit. It was so bad, it is crazy. That would be the most plausible. Like, 30 minutes to 2 hours is what I feel like most people are comfortable with. But I was thinking, should I just 
not do anything because I just spent two hours, uh, two days straight playing Pokemon. <clears throat> and I thought, I could very easily get sub eight. So nah, I'll, I'll just do it because why not? It just, it just seems, it seems normal. Probably not very normal thing to say, but it just, this just feels normal. <coughs> Good to know. Trust me, when that full factor goes into goes into action, you'll understand how fun it is. I hope you do, because these runs are brilliant. I don't have to, like, be per perfect precision the whole time. Proven by... Proven by Friday. Learning another game, nice. Is that five now, I believe? What you could be thinking of is that these types of runs for a 14 year old is a bit crazy. This one has. ACE. I'm trying to think of what that is. The first thing that came to mind, which I know it isn't, is Secret Agent Clang. It's not that because it because no s is that a game or is that a trick? Oh, a trick! Interesting. Unfortunately, most of the games I run don't have glitches. I basically only run Sword and Shield and Scarva. I don't think I've ever watched a Ocarina of Time or Paper Mario run, so I wouldn't have a clue what you're on about, to be fair. Nope, that's wrong. Great. Well, that was a brilliant start. I'm not a massive fan of Paper Mario. I can never get into it. It seems like the most logical thing for it to do. Seems quite broken. I think the only glitch thing this game has is out of bounds, which isn't even useful. I'm actually surprised that you can't go far with that glitch, as far as I'm aware. It wouldn't surprise me if there could be a route developed where you, you go to the DLC... Get the most broken thing ever. Do that out of bounds and then get to the end. That would be interesting, but probably very hard to navigate. Because you can fall on basically anything. Either that or there's just a barrier that I cannot see. Who knows exactly. I would experiment with it, but I haven't done it in like two years, and I don't remember how. And also, I don't know if I'm, I'm that interested in any percent. I mean, it would be very useful for GST as well. It would probably make sub six, maybe even five possible. 
Because it would cut off a good chunk of the game. But then you'd also have to take into account badge checks. You'd also have to check if the cutscenes load in Winden. Obviously, this has probably all been checked already. So if anyone that does glitch hunting is watching this run um, in post, for example, a verifier, I don't know. Probably I look like an idiot. It could be worth looking into. I've, I've either thought about it, <coughs> but then I always think of something else to do. Ooh, almost went for bind. I don't know. Could be interesting. But I've got things that I'm kind of more interested in. Oh, that is not a good sound. That is not a good sound. That is the sound of a tired speedrunner. <laughs> That's the sound of a tired speedrunner 20-ish minutes into an 8-hour run. Not a good sound. Like, <laughs> there is still a long way to go. I'll wake up at some point. I did only wake up, like, a half hour ago. But that's the price to play when I'm sleeping for a long time. I'm not a massive fan, I won't lie. Most of the things I drink are just water. But, eh. This game gets exciting at around the hour mark, as you could guess why. And then kind of dims down again. For the mid game. Yeah. It's quite literally just water and the odd maybe I'll have a milkshake, you know. <laughs> that sounds so stupid, but it's true. I do like me a milkshake from time to time. Coming up to the first split in the run. I actually don't know what pace this is until until the split, really. This is like the only time that I really know my pace. Uh, it's the first time I know my pace. But what ifs? Level 10. I don't remember what level the, um, what's it called is. Did I, hang on, did I just one-shot that Wulu? Was that a one or a two-shot? Two-shot, okay. I got confused then. How come you said you can't do a nine-minute run? Because, one, I have to be very, very precise in movement and stuff. Like, I have to be so much more precise in movement. And it wouldn't be much fun. I would have to be grinding out, like, I'd have 2,000 attempts done in quite literally no time at all. I'd be resetting every so often, and it just doesn't seem like fun. In my, in my time, time. In my, like, what I enjoy from speedrunning is trying to do the longest things possible. The things that no one, quite frankly, will ever do. For example, the duo factor. I doubt anyone will do the duo factor. Because, one, it's long, and only a few people will run Pokemon for a long time. And two, no one wants to play Scarlet and Violet for 12 hours. For example, I don't know if you know, Zelda speedrunner doing the all... 
all Zelda hundos back to back to back in one sitting. It's like 85 hours RTA. Stuff like that. But I can't do that type of stuff right now because one, school exists. And two, people are asleep. People are asleep when I do these runs sometimes. Or if I continue to do them. Yeah, exactly. Things like the 602. Not Mario specifically, but things like that. The Octo Factor, the Nova Factor, the, those types of runs are the runs that I enjoy most. Most of the time, I don't even care for World Record. Grinding something like 16 star for 64 just doesn't seem doesn't seem fun. I'm just doing the same thing over and over and over and over again. When for something like Glamour Star Tournament, everything's constantly changing for 8 hours. Instead of me doing the same thing like 100-ish times over the course of a few hours. And also, sometimes I get records out of them. Fuck, I keep forgetting to try Citra. I actually keep forgetting. You know what? On stream today, if we don't get a Suicune, I will try Citra. <coughs> I will do it on stream. And hopefully not dox myself. Or leak anything. <laughs> we'll see though. <laughs> hopefully not completely ruin my life. Well, to be fair, I don't think anyone cares. I need to keep remembering that I need to mash the shoulder buttons as well. That's probably why I didn't gold, because I'm not mashing shoulder buttons. Like, the game wants me to. One of the only bad things about this run is that I'm mashing shoulder buttons for essentially 8 hours. Quite fun if you think about it. Hold A, mash B, mash shoulder buttons for eight hours. You can't go to me and say that that doesn't look fun. I trust you th that it's not malware. I'm... I don't know. I'm completely lost when it comes to things... Not things like Citra. Just Citra. I can get DS, GBA... I can get every emulator but Citra. Confuses the hell out of me. Oh, I d that was on my laptop. I can't... I couldn't get it working on my laptop because the laptop is ass, as we've already discussed. Um... But it shut down before I could even think to try it on my PC. And then I keep forgetting it. <laughs> I was too excited to try this run again. Thought I jumped the gun and forgot. Trust me, Citra is coming. If I can get Citra working... Then I can officially do an Octo Factor. Or even a Nova Factor, probably. Base Gen 1 through 9. Run coming soon. Actually, I don't think anyone's done that run either. Not even in Japanese. I think the only the only multi-game run to include Scarvi has Black 2 White 2 in it. Which I don't want to run Black 2 White 2. It would be a Nova Factor base 1 through 9. I don't see a point in sitting through 6 hours of Black 2, White 2. Or Black and White and Black 2, White 2. Like, I'm adding 3 hours on for what is... Not the same speedrun, but like the same generation. Granted, Gen 5 are a brilliant speedrun. It also just means that I can run uh, Gen 6 and 7, which is quite cool. Gen 6 and 7 are a brilliant gen. I 
without having to waste like a couple grand on a fucking couple grand on a fucking um what's it called? 3DS or I wouldn't say grand, a couple hundred on a 3DS capture card and then the two games. Fuck yeah, one turn. On like the four fucking turn in the duo factor. Which that was the first time that it was a shit run. I was not trying in that run at all. Like I even missed the I even missed the death warp. Like I failed a death warp. That run was horrible. If you watch the VOD of Friday you would understand where I'm coming from if you haven't already. But alas, surprisingly, I'm still yet to be fucked over by um dens. I'm actually, I'm going to assume Duke uses it for the 3DS games, right? The Skylander games. I'm assuming that's why. Something else that feels brilliant is now I know that I can do runs that are like 20 hours. I just wanted to mention that. I can now like officially do runs that are 20 hours without sweating so hard. So even some other runs could come into play from other franchises. Probably not, though. Like, I don't think I can run any other franchise that isn't Pokemon. Like, to that extent. Maybe, like, a two-hour run for uh, something else. Though, again, I don't like to grind those types of runs. Right, I need to quickly scroll down. I remember just now, off the top of my head, equip the fucking Mystic Water. I remembered.
fuck's sake, obviously quick attack. I got a minute to beat this and then we go. Wait, now it's a minute in like three seconds. You know what, that works. That's fine, because it doesn't matter, please. Okay, wasted a turn because it used quick attack, that's fine. Oh, and then I crit it, which wasted more time. Fucking brilliant. What? Do I mashed B? Basically, from now until the end of Suicune, we can lose six minutes. Welcome back. I'm still on a 7.48 pace. I know it's only been 40 minutes, but that's quite good. Another example, going back to the 9 minute run, by now you probably could have done 4.5-ish of those runs. I would be bored already. That's a long load. It's a long cutscene to skip. Right, we're almost at the part where it's like, yay, reset. Maybe, we'll see. This could go horrible and probably still be good, so. I don't know what to say. Again, from the team yell, we can lose six minutes until the end of Suicune, and then we are uh, fine.
Nice. I didn't mess it up. It was a bit slow, but I didn't mess it up. I also updated the commands for Mochi 200 and... Maybe not 200. Um, Mochi and GST to now include the routes that I use. Because I found that that could be interesting for people. Instead of me having to grab the link to shove it in. I believe it's a good idea. I also put in who made the roots. So for Jesty would be Teapot and Mochi would be Crisis. It just means that I don't have to do anything. The only thing I have to say is use exclamation mark GST or some crap. Just feel nice to have comparison splits and I'm ahead of them. I'm a lot more ahead of PB. I just want to say, PB, I'm a lot more ahead. Because PB had a awful run all throughout, basically. Until the catches, it was a awful run right to the end. It really shows me how shit I am at this game. All my PB is. I gotta remember that this isn't Scarlet and Violet, and I can be within 20 feet of them, and they won't encounter me. I'm still pissed about that execute yesterday. I was literally on the other side of the fucking wall, basically. I was ages away from that execute, and it's still encountered. That's probably like this distance away, and it's still encountered. Like, that game is broken as fuck, man. Nope.
Uh oh. Oh, actually, all the options are shit. Please, Manetric. Thank you. It doesn't matter what I took. All the options are bad. Water, normal, gorilla. Right, I need to want re read those because that was bad. Okay, we are normal. Um, grass, ground, or steel. Yeah, we're all good going normal. There's only one Pokemon that can't hit it, and there's Dusclops. Um, or if it has a move to hit, then it can't hit Dusclops. This could be really good or really bad. Double bulky. This could be good. We'll see. I want to use those water moves actually. I want to use those water moves because I can't use them on Suicune. Or actually any of the next two Pokemon. Oh, I want to see what type of moves this Pokemon has. <coughs> oh, Life Dew is really good actually. Body press. Oh, I just weakened overheat. What a fucking guitar of mine. A grassy glide. Oh, this could be worth the little worth. You know, what, I'm gonna go for it. We're gonna catch double because I just saw grassy glide. Follow me. Overheat's gonna do fuck all. Never mind. Max Overgrowth. Yeah. Okay, we're going for this. Yeah, we're going to waste like 30 seconds catching this. I want that, please. Yeah, grassy glide, body press, mega kick, substitute. Um, well, good grass, just to save a bit of time. Lilligan. I could catch this, honestly, as well. Petal dance. Oh, it's crap. Uh, I might catch Lilligan too, honestly. That max overgrowth is scary. Oh, this is a very good team. Yeah, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna catch Lilligant as well. This life do is actually saving my life. Usually it wouldn't, but today it's actually saving my life. 
don't know if it's worth. No, I don't think it's worth dynamaxing. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go for this. Dude, there's a little gun. No, please go overheat. If if whatever uses overheat doesn't use oh, Mr. Fire? Overheat, please. No, bro, I should have done it. No. That's bad. I could die now. It needs to not hit Dust Clops, me or Dust Clops. That's fine. Psychic Fangs. Okay. That's fine. That honestly probably saves turns over Dynamaxing. Right, we're going to catch this, and then this will be what we use in the... What's it called? Okay, this is two fight deathless. We have four minutes to finish two fights and some dialogue. And then we gold all we can... We can lose like six minutes. We have like 20... We have like 10 minutes to finish. Preferably not 10 minutes, but that's how long we have. Yes, Quiver Dance, Light Screen, Pollen Puff, um, what's it called? I don't know what she gives. Um, no. <coughs> uh, we got Ground here. That heals Manetric and Dusclops. Unfortunately, not much can deal with Ground. Minetra can use like Psychic Fangs, maybe. That's good. Poison type. Poison, so Psychic Fangs? If I can know my... If I know my type chart, Psychic Fangs could do something. That does... That still does quite a bit. Pell Dance is not super effective, but it should be fine. How many... Yeah, Mystical Fire not going to do much. How many PP does Pedal Dance have? Is it only 10? No, that is not great. Why did you do that? Oh, am I locked into Pedal Dance? Fuck, dude. Shadow Ball. Yes! Hex. Dynamax. Oh, 10 PP. We're just going to go for it. You know what? Screw it. We're going for it. <coughs> We're just going to have to go for it because... Um, whatever that move was turned to max guard. We're going to have... Preferably 6 going into Suicune. Maybe less. We might have seven going in. Or even eight, rather. If we can kill it from here. I don't think we can kill it from here. Yeah, but healing Togetic. Honestly, good move. This life do is saving me right now. Okay, we have seven... Seven... What's it called? Petal Dancers going into Suicune. I don't want this. <coughs> we have four lives and a good Pokemon. manetric has gone. That's eh, not the greatest. That's not great considering it just got swapped out for a ground type, but it's fine. Pressure might be nice. Oh no, it has pressure! Shit! That means we only have like four. Because pressure uses two PP. That's good. Hang on, we're gonna probably use bug moves until I can Dynamax. Yes, you are right. What a turn! 
What <laughs> fucking did? Basically half gone already. Okay, we're losing time now, which is fine. That was pointless, wasn't it? Did I set up quiver and then it get immediately destroyed? Okay, I can done with. I, I don't know if I set up quiver. I don't think I did because. <sighs> Don't worry about the time. The time means absolutely nothing right now. Yeah, boy. This terrain is not very useful, but it's fine. Ooh, okay, one death. That's fine, however, that was the Pokemon that was using Life Do. So that's kind of annoying. Oh, that's two deaths. Okay, one, either this dust swaps kills it, or we kill it next turn. Own oh, tempo. That's quite annoying. That's time loss. I will admit that this coming back in is pointless, because I can just kill it myself. This is like six or seven seconds gone. GG. And we continue. <laughs> That's... I don't care about being this far behind. Because, again, as we established, PB was five minutes behind. <laughs> five minutes. And it also still had a shit Articuno. It was a bad Articuno and five minutes behind coming out of Suicune. Usually I'd reset this, but I'm going to continue. Just because this is... This is actually quite good. Sub-8 incoming, hopefully. <coughs> if you look at my BPT, we're going to have like a 7.54. No! Aha, fuck you. <laughs> but I just scared all of your damn brains. How much I can? How much dynite ore did I just get? Because I didn't check it twice. I'm sure it was eight, right? I almost gave myself a heart attack. Don't you worry. I swear that was eight, right? An actually decent run. It doesn't look like it, but it's an actually decent run. We're about to be plus fucking four. <coughs> we are plus 350 right now. Technically, yeah. It all depends on these legendaries now. We basically just have to sit tight and for like... Five and a half hours. The only thing I know is that PB got like a 104, like a, a late 104, or a high 104, sorry. But now it's just five and a half hours of doing complete fuck all.
No worries. Good luck. Oh shit, no, I was meant to buy from him. 22x special. 3x defense. 4x specials. I'm gonna get to the move relearner. Okay, I need to shut my window during this fight. Because it's blasting wind everywhere and I don't want it to blow open like yesterday. I think it was yesterday, right? I just remember the, the last run was two days long. Seeing we've already saved 44 seconds. That was a gold by I don't know how much. I also already ran into an optional here by this point. I'd already hit an optional. I had... I flew to the wrong Pokemon Center. I was already plus five. The movement was slow. Like, I don't understand how the, that run PB'd at all. But I trust that this run can sub 8. I mean it can because I could have the exact same run and it would sub 8. <coughs> Actually no. I could, I could follow basically my goal. Nothing is stopping me today. Nothing. I, I don't believe that I can be stopped. Actually, that's probably a lie. Uh, probably, uh, probably a lie.
feels kind of annoying that I'm playing 30 minutes out of my... My PB is 30 minutes slower than my sob. Like, it just doesn't... Like, I don't know. Feels weird. It feels weird that I'm playing so far off of my best. Like, I'm losing, like, I'm already behind on the B split before I even enter the mines. That's crazy. Like, that's what I find baffling. Another gold, though. <laughs> Something I need to do is make sure I like properly follow the splits because sometimes I'm menuing twice when I really don't need to. And it loses quite a bit of time. Because <coughs> that probably adds up to about... Three, four minutes. And at the minute, every minute is counting in this run. Like, I will take any bit of time saved. Like, I've done so many attempts... A sub eight, and it's just within reach every time. Like, menuing is one of my biggest weaknesses besides just having clean movement and not hitting optionals. Ah, fuck, dude. See, like, this random... This random dumb time save that really doesn't... Like, no, time loss that really doesn't need to happen.
Okay. A bit on the slower end, but it's okay. So they all stay together. That's also fine, because they all stay together. No, what the fuck? Okay, well that's bolts, but like, whatever. Okay, that was very slow. That was very slow because for some reason the, pl the pack split in half. What happens if we lose time on the split? Let's see how long this cutscene actually is. Because 108, I hit the button. So I want to see how long it takes to kill a Dynamax Pokemon. It's 20 seconds. Dirty. Yeah, okay, I'm losing time. Hopefully not too much. 15 seconds?
12 and a half. Yeah, this is going to be a very, very, very bad comparison probably for the rest of the run. Probably not up until... The Legendary. It's probably not up until Articuno. We're probably going to be behind. Probably be even further behind because um, the Reggies and shit. Oh, I don't go for extreme speed, not so. My bad. Should be fine, though. I doubt one PP is going to matter so much. Especially when I'm pretty sure the only surf up until Nessa is Dreadnought. Dreadnought aka the last possible move in the entire fucking run. That works. Mm. 
Jesus Christ. Also, the very bad gym puzzle in the pool.
Nice. I'm actually not behind going into the fight, which is promising. I will be up behind in five seconds. Maybe like a five, ten second goal. Obviously, that's just me guessing, so I ain't got fucking clue about this run. Okay, maybe two. <laughs> maybe a two second goal. Overall, in the early game, I saved 49 seconds. If we go to the Isle of Armor.
So it's nice we got the EXP charm now. I am ready for this battle mustard. Whoop yo all ass. I just gotta hope that it doesn't use fake out. I've never, I don't think I've ever seen it use fake out before. Yeah, but you're level 13, Shinx, so you're gonna do fuck all. Fuck's sake, dude. I always do this. I always run into a whooper. I think every fucking PB has run into at least one whooper. Great, and I missed the fucking thing. Okay, I didn't miss that one.
Nice interception. Shit, dude, I knew I was gonna do it. Oh, yeah, this was the definite slower way. I can, ne I never remember the fastest way through here, and that was not it because an encounter and I had to go backtrack and shit. That definitely could have cost me gold on there. I was 11, but it's fine. Yeah, 
Yeah, unfortunately, we're gonna lose a bit more time here. Unfortunate, but I guess it's okay. We should still save a bunch of time of uh, coming out of the game. We got 15 seconds to kill one mom. Losing to gold. Yeah, we're gonna lose like f five ish, maybe. Yeah. We saved 20 seconds. We've saved another 20 seconds in the max mushroom section. So we should probably be losing time because I'm pretty sure this gold is fucked up. So we won't know now where we are until Marnie won. Also we actually hit a random encounter. Well, technically, the gold doesn't matter. But my PB does it right, I'm pretty sure, so. No, don't be text. Thank you. I have no idea if Bead does text or not. Doesn't look like it, but we'll see. Yeah, so we're going to be probably losing time due to hitting a random encounter. Probably like 15. Yeah. 
Not very often can I call how much time I'm losing. Well, now we are essentially back to where we were leaving early game. Which is mm, fine. Kind of kind of weird that Car Call has teeth. Fuck, dude. Come on. It's probably... I'm probably not gaining... Uh, I'm not probably not saving any time because these encounters are quite for probably the same amount of time as this fucking optional takes. I probably lost more fucking time than anything. This run is like... Eh. This run's incredibly solid. Not outstanding, but it's solid.
Um, incredibly mediocre so far. Um, Max Mushrooms went well. Galar Mine 2 went horrible. Two, two randoms. Um, however, I didn't hit an optional. But everything else has been just solid. The fuck? Okay, never mind. This run's actually kind of good now. <laughs> just out of nowhere. <laughs> but I'm... I don't want to believe that that's real. That could be real. Literally, as I say that this run's mediocre, I just out of the blue get a random gold, so... If that's real, then this run's okay. But I don't know where I would get 55 seconds from. I guess maybe I hit an optional? But then I hit two wilds. <coughs> I hope that's real. That must be real, though, because bead 2 is, I think, the only messed up gold. Because my gold goes to the restaurant before Isle of Armor. And I don't, want to, I don't really want to mess up my gold and fix it. Which is why that one's in the red. Other than that, I'm not sure. Well, we've got about six hours left to find out. There's also a bit of time to save on PB coming up here, um, the A08-34, um, because I failed a death warp. I failed the Mudstale death warp, because I hit no to warping. Which is a bit fucking stupid. Very much appreciated. But sometimes I do agree that I am crazy. But tr if I if I enjoy something like this, I will grind it no matter how long it is or takes. Also, I need to grab some food because my stomach is rumbling. So when I hit Surf for Arcanine, I can leave because I have to use Surf on Center Scorch anyway.
I need to use extreme speed, and then as soon as I hit um, Surf on Arcanine. And the only reason you use extreme speed is because I'm pretty sure this thing has quick attack. Okay, let me get ready to... Move, um, I don't know if it matters. I don't think it does. It's just faster because menuing. I have actually no idea why it, it's swapped there, so. Continuing this from two and a half minutes behind was definitely a good move. to open my chocolate fingers. Fuck. Yeah, boy. Right, let's not fuck up the death warp. Woohoo. I also suck at the menuing to upgrade my bike. Example. Dude.
Thank you. Go ahead and fuck it up. That's a lot of time save on PB. That's gotta be like a minute or two. On the 
Okay. Is this surf spam? I'm pretty sure it is, right? Literally, yeah. So I need to wait for Crawl to look at my DM for the duo factor. I sent him a DM about rules and break rules and sh uh, maybe potential break rules of what I think would be good. Um, I need to see him. I don't think he has. I mean, he might have like, no fucking clue. I was literally just surf until hop. Every fight is surf until hop. Bye bye, Opal. Move. Fun fact I don't think I've ever had an, a good. Uh, Articuno in any of these runs. I think all of these runs have been absolutely ass. Um, in terms of Articuno. Duncan. I don't think I want to start practicing Mochi until sub 8 in this game. Because this. Sub 8 is literally within reach every single run that I do. Like, I don't know. Sub 8 just seems like that thing that I need to get before I move on.
you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Wait, no. Please don't throw gold. This could be a really, really good hop five. Thank you. That could have been like gold out the fucking window. Oh, hey, would you look at that? We're ahead. Fuck yeah. <laughs> it only took two hours and 20 minutes to turn it around. Now we just got to keep that fucking lead.
Boom. <coughs> Look at this shit, man. Smoking. I'm gonna grab a drink because this entire fight is spam, sir. And here we are. I drank half a cup of fucking water.
Boom. That was due to me just not matching fast enough. Okay, now that I've had my brunch. It's time to go psycho. I got over an hour of this crap. So over an hour of the mid game.
Well, this run, I'm going to risk the calm lane. Okay. I don't know which Pokemon is arranged to need Calm Mind. I'm gonna assume it's this one. I'm gonna assume that this Surf is arranged. And that I'm gonna assume that I'm not gonna hit it. I did hit the range. Perfect. Fair enough. <coughs> We've gone from being plus 229 to minus 103. <coughs> this run is going swift.
bang, bang. I don't think I'm confused, right? So now we've got less than an hour to go of mid-game. That's how good this run is. Unfortunately. No. We're losing time on gold, it's fine. I really don't care that much. We lost ten seconds to gold. Wait, was that a token of over there? Hang on a frickin' minute. Yes, it was. Let's go. <clears throat> With a 5% spawn rate, it's crazy. That was a bit of time loss, but that's fine. That's two right there. If we don't see a Togo tomorrow now, then we know it was time save. Or no, we know it was worth going for. And there's one right on the stairs. I'm gonna encounter this bitch, aren't I? Yep. Literally could not be in a worse spot. The problem with that is, is that that's also the Pokemon that we need, so... I lost time going back for it. That's not the hyper potion. That's also time loss. Random fucking encounter away. is also a bad root fucking eight. Whoa, what is going on? I 
I've got to have lost like a minute here just to encounter this. Togemaru encounter, random encounter, boulder encounter. Move. Move. Right, I failed this trainer skip in PB. And I did again. I don't know how, but I did. Okay, unlike PB though, I didn't face the trainer. Because I realized that I can do it in more than one thing in a jiggy. I think so. Oh, fuck off. So that's to be like the fucking worst I've done now. That was horrible. That was good, but the rest was horrible.
still need cruel to damn me by. It'd be really funny if he damn me during a run that beat his sign. It's only two minutes off of crawl. Crawl has like a 806. Like, I could genuinely beat him in this run. No! Oh shit, no, I didn't kill him. It's fine because I didn't kill the frost man. I thought that was the Darmanitan and I meant to set up on the Darmanitan. Just spam extra sensor. Great. That's good. I'll take this fight. There's only a bit of menuing mistakes, but other than that, it's fine. It was a good fight. It was a horrible, like, Route 8. So if this golds, I'll be shocked. Three random encounters. Three random encounters, one of them being a token of iron. After I'd already caught a token of iron. Four encounters, one intentional. Uh, no, we do not teach them. Yeah, so you want a seven. We gold it by one second. Because I sometimes don't win this fight, um, it's only like seven, eight seconds. <coughs> uh, we're gonna equip the Mystic Water. Just because I'm scared. Like, this split shouldn't have 24 seconds of time save, I don't think.
Why not? I can Carmine. I know I can Carmine here. I don't have to go with an X special. So we sift double Pinkitchen, swap to extra century for Zen race and then back to Sift. Let's not like some Corvin Oh yeah, and we teach Hydro in slot 3. Over E speed. What an idiot. What an idiot. What the hell, man. Yeah, when I just rammed a bike into you and you're still alive. Unfortunately, I don't buy that he's okay. What? And how fair is that, may I ask? I'm not going to be losing time because I don't get an encounter on this route, ever. <coughs> but it's fun because as soon as I touch the water, a whale spawns on top of me. Oh, I'm going to lose it. Whelma. Fuck off. I'm not even 
10 seconds into this route and I've already had two wild encounters. When my usual count is none. I usually do a thing called not getting counters. <coughs> yeah, that did not work. Torment. Now I've got to risk Hydro. I got to risk Hydro, and I never hit Hydro. I literally could not tell you the last time I hit a Hydro Pump. I cannot tell you the last time I hit a Hydro Pump. Okay. Really? Oh yeah, because I hit two Whelmers. Fucking idiot. I still think it's stupid that I hit two fucking Whelmers. Two Whelmers! I'm definitely losing time. <coughs> Not even a set. I didn't even lose point two. Had such good potential to.
Yeah, that was slow, man. You're my bad. <coughs> that was slow because I am um, an idiot and keep forgetting where moves are. Gotta wiggle jiggle these hands a bit. I got lost then, Rosé. No, don't do this crap to me. No, 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 no. I've just been double signed attacked. Is this where gold goes to crap now? Mornings have already missed one and two. I'm probably going to miss a few more. I'm probably going to miss a few more, mate. Screw contrary. Yeah, this is where I lose it, isn't it? There's two misses so far. Two. We've had two misses. One on Scrafty, one on Malama. He's going to use Obstruct. Wait, do I have an X accuracy? No, I don't. I'm just going to... He's going to use Obstruct. No, he doesn't. I miss. There's three misses. Three misses now. I'm losing. I'm going to be losing so much time to these misses. Three misses, an obstruct. And of course, I hit this one. I hit the one that he obstructs. Now we have Stunky. Oh, Skun Tank's fine. Yeah, now I'm losing like 10 seconds ish. Actually, more than that. Probably like 20. I'm losing most of my time save. Three misses and an obstruct, mate. 20 to 25, I guess. That's so annoying. 21. 21 because I got sand attack twice and had to miss. I missed three surfs.
Oh, fucking it. Fuck off, man. Saving that booster immediately gets wasted. No, oh, I did it again, man. I did a random shitty entrance where I really don't fucking need it. I just got told I have 12 outdated drivers, so... Try and fix it.
We are almost out of mid game. Woohoo! It's only been half over half this fucking run. Nice. Also something that, um, that uh, yesterday, or the 808-34, did was find Dedene really fast. I kind of remember where Dedene spawns, so that should be some time save over... That should be time save over this one. I need to reset my capture card. It's like a fucking meerkat, aren't they? The next time he does it, I'm closing the window. Next time I can get up and he does it, I'm closing the window.
Dude, I did it again where I didn't go to the Pokemon Center. I did this on Friday. Fuck's sake. I hate this stupid game. Oh, because I had to shut a fucking window. Because a kid would not stop screaming at the top of his lungs. Brilliant. Um. <coughs> now I, I TP to the wrong fucking place. Oh, I'm losing my patience here. Twenty-one forest stores. I didn't buy twenty-one forest stores. Just buy the fucking forest stores. Wait, what? I have twenty-one forest stores. I guess I did. I'm losing so much time here. It's completely unfucking real. I can only afford ninety-one. Usually I have like a hundred and fifty. Oh, I bought twenty-one forest stores. <sighs> that is not great. Anyway, I'm losing way too much time here. That cost me like a minute and a half, probably more actually. Meaning that I'm probably behind BB by now. Because I had to, first of all, fly. Then I flew to the wrong Pokemon Center. Then I went in and tried to buy four stores twice. Then I bought too many. Like, way too much went wrong in that section. That cost me like a minute and a half, probably more. Which is really, really annoying, because that's all of my time save. To be quite frank, literally all of it. Really, 14 seconds? There's a minute and a half of time saving yet. That's not happening. Or two minutes, sorry. <coughs> that whole mi two minutes is gone. Because I had to fly and then I fucked up so many menus. By the way, world record would be halfway through the run by now. Me on the other hand. 
In fact, it'd be over halfway. Record would be like 30 minutes over halfway. Right, I got one more. To, ooh, this could be good. Yeah, we could be really, really, really far behind. Uh, really, 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 really far ahead by now. Unfortunately, by the time we actually leave this section, we're only going to have five minutes to play for sub eight. Which is going to be scary. <coughs> come on, 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 come on. Wow, we're going to be saving a f couple of seconds. There's still a shit ton of time saved in that section, though. Okay, the mid-game, we saved about two minutes, however. There's still quite a lot to do in that section. Yeah, still quite a lot to do in that section. Um, it's still, like, over a minute and ten seconds of time saved left.
Okay, let's just put turbo on. There's literally nothing to do in this fight. I can actually put the controller down for two minutes. I was gonna react gold, but I forgot the splits exist. It's like lukewarm water. Horrible.
Fucking hell, dude. Such clean movement, almost perfect. Until again, a fucking Drapion spawns in front of me. Even though it doesn't happen as much, a Scarlet and Violet shit does still spawn right in front of you. A minute from this point on to kill mustard. All it takes is two surfs. seconds. Basically, you could take take off 10 seconds and you'd basically have a brilliant segment.
That could have been like a 22 second goal. We can somehow save like 40 ish seconds. This could be sub two, uh, sub four, Marnie three. Wait, am I torment? I'm gonna probably actually lose time on this split because I don't know if I'm torment. I don't think so. If I've taken damage, I'm not. Okay, I'm not torment. Well, it's not because we have GMAX Grim Snow. As completely pointless as any time save is from this point up until about the Reggies, like just before the Reggies. As completely pointless as it is, it is fun to know that I've knocked my sob down by like two minutes. And I can be like five minutes ahead coming out of late game. It's fun to know that it's possible. As much as it really doesn't matter. Because this minute could all instantly go on Reggie Steel. Like it the, the amount that this time save matters is quite literally zero. And could be zero. For the whole fucking run. I don't know how much it matters. How much it means. It means absolutely nothing. This time save means nothing to me until until after all the legis, uh, le not legis, legendaries have been caught. But until then, you can all fuck off. <laughs> this two minutes could instantly be gone in the matter of two minutes.
Absolute Dawson. I don't think I could do this section any faster. That has to be the fastest fight. That has to be the fastest top eight of my life. If this doesn't gold, I will be shocked. <coughs> Literally some of my fastest menuing. And paired with fucking... Paired with them... Um, me literally using... Me actually using the auto too. I haven't held the controller basically the entire fight. So if I don't gold, then fucking hell, there's something wrong with the game. I'm not gonna gold. <laughs> Actually, fuck off, I'm not gonna go. That balls, man. That was 10 seconds slower. I don't know where the fuck that 10 seconds is, but I guess what else? Also, happy halfway through the run. We are officially halfway through the run now.
Dude, my index finger hurts like fucking crazy, man. Looks like more resetting capture card time.
Probably the most boring part of the entire run. It's actually just a gauntlet of eight fights. Eight fights in 15 minutes, that's what this is. It's like... There's, there's no really need for like three fights on the elevator. And three Cosmos Eric fights. Maybe one Eric fight, one Elijah, uh, one Elevator fight, and then one Oleana fight. Like, it really should be three and not eight. Like, you find Eric three times, fight him on the last one. And on the elevator, you get halfway up, fight someone, and then done. Like, there's really no need for three fights. Three fights, and Eric has two Pokemon each fight. In the sake of 15 minutes, you're killing... Seventeen Pokemon in fifteen minutes, that's how many you're killing. If you include double every single fight. <coughs> that's seventeen death animations in fourteen minutes. When usually it's three to six. Personally, I just don't think it works. It's actually not bad. We've got a minute to kill Garboda. And we've already watched the majority of the uh, animation. Garboda. That's like a fucking menace. Oh, what the fuck would you look at that? I saved the whole minute in there. I was looking at gold. I wasn't even looking at potential PB.
after the duo factor, this now feels like a really, really short category. Because <coughs> if we're looking at the duo factor, I wouldn't even be a quarter of the way into the run. And not even halfway into the day. With this, I'm over halfway into the run and way over halfway into the day. Like, this run is half of the duo factor, and this run feels like... I've, I'm more accustomed to it because... Like, this is 8 hours, whilst the duo factor was 20. 20 and a half. And I did this run in the duo factor. It's just like, I'm perfectly, like, normal right now. I will feel no different after this run. In fact, I will feel better after this run. I will probably boot up Scarvai thinking that I need to do Mochi. If I had one extra day off, I definitely would have. Like, you'd see me doing this run again. G Max Adorini! This Pokemon carried me through casual. Hundred and fifty nine okay, I need to hope that I level up here. So I can check from hundred and fifty nine special attack. Oh, it doesn't matter because I gotta do it anyway. Okay, yeah, never mind.
Why is it so decent? The fuck? Next time I'm gonna try and see if it's the web browser that's lagging. Special attack turn one and then hold surf like usual. No, it desynced again somehow, but whatever. I guess it's the last time I'm fucking doing this shit. It's good, because most of these fights, I don't even have to hold the controller. This is the easy part about this run. Got the Japan, the Japan any percent record in shield. A seven oh four fifty two, a uh, seven uh, four oh seven fifty two. Sorry. GG to Yuki.
That was my mashing for you. Exactly. I'll tell you what could go wrong. Uh, this Guja doesn't use Rain Dance. There you go. Because if the Guja didn't use Rain Dance, that's another X special. <coughs> Three X specials if no Rain Dance. Okay, now we just hold Surf. GG. That's the tournament done. Most of it was just X special, put turbo on surf, done. But yo, this could be a gold. Probably not, actually. I mean, there's not really much place to lose time after Oleana. But whatever. Yeah, the board um, has turbo, no turbo. My PB is um, turbo. I'm I'm last with turbo. Out of the last seven runs on the board. I'm the only one that uses turbo. There are only four different runners that have used turbo. A Peugeot, Truly, Crisis, and me. Um, and everyone else. There's out of 14 people, only four use turbo. <coughs> but uh, turbo is my lord and savior. I mean, I still have to mash the two shoulder buttons for god knows how long, but... It's better than having to mash three buttons and hold one down. Right, we did it. It's time for Eternatus, which is a 20 minute segment. And we have to do stupid slumbering world movement. Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. There's a minute and 16 of time saving here. Really? To be fair, it doesn't surprise me. I mean, for what's in the split, like, this cutscene, running to the Slumbering World, running back, or teleporting back to Hammerlock, fighting Rose, going up to Eternatus, beating Phase 1, watching, like, a two-minute cutscene, and then doing, like, five minutes of fighting Eternamax, it's quite short. For what's actually in the split, yeah. Most of this time save is probably encounters.
Ready? Lag. Lag when we run up. Yeah, look at that lag. It's not as bad as Scarvi. And it's also like the first piece of lag in the entire run. It's desynced again, dude. Everything keeps desyncing in terms of audio. This is like the fifth time in 10 minutes. Unless it isn't. Okay, no, we might be fine. I've tried to reload the tab because apparently that can help. No, it is definitely broken. Fucking hell, dude. Literally like the fifth time in 10 minutes. What the fuck did I just open? Whoa, what the fuck? <laughs> I just opened up... Program pre- what? Whoa. <laughs> I'm, I'm confused. Yeah. Oh, studio mode. I opened up studio mode. That's good. <laughs> That scared the fucking shit out of me. Oh, fuck off! That's like 30 seconds down the drain to encounters already. And I've not even made it to the hard maneuvering part. Right, left, right, right, left, left. SV is definitely made on lag. If you don't reset the game in an 90% run, Kofu will literally... Kaskarafa and the intro to Kofu literally runs on two frames. It's probably more like six, but like, you can count the frames... Go for it. Um, I watched T Pat run this in a race with etiquette on the boards one day and I also got interested in it just because of the look of it and then the very next day I thought fuck it I'll do a run just like the duo factor I did it I liked it I did it again to improve and then I did a third one because the, the 819 wasn't that great and then I was very close to sub 8 this is just Crisis said this, I think, in the intro to his GST. He prefers the categories that do more than just any percent. Those are my favorite categories. And this is sort of extended any percent. Or the closest to 100% that we have of this game. Same with Mochi. Because I don't think anyone wants to run 100% of this game. Whew. But I watched T-Pat run it once. It looked interesting. I ran it. And it was almost 9 hours. And I felt like I was going to die. I have a goal. In fact, I have 3 milestones that I want to achieve. The first one is sub 8. Then it is sub 7.30 at some point. And then I want to beat T-Pat. Because T-Pat has the fastest time on a physical copy of Pokemon Shield. Which is what I'm playing on. So I know that I can achieve that time. And his time's like a 7.17. And if I really, really, really want to push for it, I will go for that. Which I kind of do because 
it'll really help me in the duo factor. <coughs> but 717 is a long way away when I'm talking about trying to get under 8 hours. Okay. I just have to make sure I didn't have to do anything. But sub 8 is the one that I can very easily get. As you can see, my sob being a 744. Like, I could lose 15 minutes in this run and still PB. Not considering that this um, comparison gets bad Zapdos as well. So this comparison gets bad Zapdos and Articuno, whilst my PB, the one from the Duo Factor, only gets a bad um, Articuno. But I did have to chase after Zapdos in that. Because <coughs> I, I royally fucked that one up. But this is all now. Any milestone past sub 8 will probably just come with time of practice for Duo Factor. I just wanted to do this run today because I knew. No! Yeah, fuck you. <laughs> fuck you, mate. <laughs> fuck you, Rose. You can't get me this time, mate. Fuck off. Not getting me this time. I'm pretty sure this split loses two minutes or a minute and a half to teaching Blizzard over Surf. And then losing this fight, having to go back, reteach Surf, and do this fight again. Not doing it to me twice. Fuck off. Fuck right off. That's why there's a minute 16 in this time save. That's why. Because I'm locked into Blizzard, I'm pretty sure. Three times. I'm hoping. We did lose a bit of time to three random encounters in Slumbering World, though. But Eternamax is free. It's extrasensory on Eternatus. Then guards back and then just spam extra sensory again. So we've got time save there. Then it's the Dene and then Leon. But I actually know where Dedene is. <coughs> I think I know where Dedene is anyway. Yeah, fuck you, Rose. That's also scary because it was one input away and I had the I had the stupid turbo thing where it's like I don't have to press the button and it's pressing it. So I was inches away from messing that up. I was an inch from messing that up because I had to press the turbo button and and the A button. Twin children are literally just playing as Tobias. I don't know what Tobias is, unfortunately. Oh, I don't have to. I don't know why I'm pressing anything. Oh. Now I have to press something. Fuck, dude. I put my controller down and then I have to press something. Diamond Pearl anime series. I am not one with the anime, unfortunately. <coughs> I 
I don't think I've watched the anime since Sun and Moon, probably. I watched a lot of Sun and Moon. Went back, watched a bit of what is it, Indigo Plateau, whatever the first one was called, and then did not watch Gen Eight. What was it, Journeys? I've thought about watching Horizons again, and then never watched Horizons. That's my thought on the anime. I've thought about doing a challenge run for Horizons, like a category extension. Um. What the fuck? That is... I wish I could do that. <coughs> I've thought about doing a, like, what's her name? Lilo? Lila? Whatever her name is, doing a challenge run where you can only use her Pokemon. Which would be... The only one I know is Sprigatito. I watched, like, the first episode and that was it. Okay. That probably sounds about right. Oh yeah, and Hathana. I knew there was one other that I couldn't think of. But when that whole like series is done, do like a run based on that? We're probably doing for Swish about um go. I can just now I can leave the controller down because I'm not doing anything. But I like those types of runs. For example, Pokemon Yellow has Ash percent. Um, what's it called? Let's go has Bootleg Ash. Though Ash percent has you catch thirty Tauros in the Safari Zone or twenty nine, one of the two. Which is stupidly nuts. I swear to God. It. Okay. But it, it's quite funny. <coughs> yeah, now I just do this because I'm not doing anything. I turned off the auto turbo so I don't fuck it up. I don't know what Ash had for Swish, honestly, or Journeys, whatever it was. If it was that, then that sounds interesting. But you can't really do it as that because there's no... I don't think they did gym leaders and Journeys and shit. <coughs> you just have to do, like, obtain those Pokemon or something. Yeah, I do have, um, I think it's the official guidebook for Swish, and it has three Pokemon. I think it's Yampa, Crawdon, and there's another one. Um, just following that, and then doing, like, a baton pass with that. Like, you have your starter, and then when it says catch this, because it does say that, you catch that baton pass with it. Like, you just completely switch mains to that, and then switch when it says. That could be a fun one. I'm a good fan of um, category extensions. Where are the guards back here? Hello. Back it? So if I said your name wrong, welcome, welcome. Okay. Now I just spam uh, extra sensory. Yeah, I'm kind of disappointed that, um... Sword and Shield got a lot of category extensions, like... 
Just to list a few. <coughs> if I can open the category extensions, please. We have Alt Root with a bunch of Pokemon. Alt means without a Tinnitus and a bunch of Pokemon. Alt means with a Tinnitus, Isle of Armor, Alt means trade Alt means complete post game, flex on, Dynamax Adventure, Dex Entry, All Trainers, Rotom Rally Race, and that says Boobs Percent. What the hell is Boobs Percent? Okay, that was fine. This should gold though, potentially. My Discord, no. Oh, profile on Discord, nice. Um, you side flip in front. Is that intended? That's the question. That is. That sounds worse than nipple percent in Mario Odyssey. That sounds worse. This sounds, this sounds like the stupidest thing. Which game is this in? That sounds like the. Huh? Oh shit, I can't. 2002. Oh god. Really? Re really? You really gonna make me check this? I need to know how long this is. I need to fucking look at my notes. <laughs> Hang on. Hang the fuck on. I need to. I just need to just do some menuing real quick. That's not the right man. You've completely like stutter shocked me at the minute. Rack one. No, that's the wrong thing. That's not the Cadex. That's just rack one. Yeah, I just clicked on the wrong one on accident. Mm. Yeah. There you are. See, I figured it out. I've learned Dedene's whereabouts. That's my last quick ball. Why? I don't know. Oh, there it is. Why is the record from six days ago? It's six... No. Disgrace. Yeah, I've had it with other streams where it just delays like mad. Next thing you know, I'm like 10 minutes. Fair enough. Oh, I didn't reteach Nuzzle. Actually, that doesn't matter for this. 
Okay. I forgot to teach Nuzzle, but that doesn't really matter. It doesn't matter for this fight. I'll just do it after the credits. I'll take the time loss and do it after the credits. <coughs> no, we don't get sub five. No. No sub five any percent. Unlucky. It's going to be more because I actually didn't get lost to trying to find Dedene. I think I spent like a minute trying to find Dedene on this um, split. It's not more than a minute, but maybe around a minute. And then we get like a two minute breathing break, something like that. So we just set up two items, X special and the max mushrooms. Fuck knows what they do, but here we are. I'm assuming so he goes for King Shield, right? Because one of these turns he's guaranteed King Shield, probably. Oh, that is like an Omni boost right there. Holy shit. Okay, I cannot just leave this fight because it's Flamethrower, two Dynamax Cannons, Flamethrower, and then two Dynamax Cannons. Yeah, okay, now he goes for King Shield. On the turn that I'm attacking, he goes King Shield. Okay, so now I'm going to turn down. That was a 14 Pokemon when it should have been a 3. I didn't until I did this run for the first time. But there's... I mean, if... I don't know. <laughs> Might as well. I mean, I'm not using them for anything else. Okay, we got one more flamethrower, then we switch to Dynamax Cannon, and then we're done. We're done with Leon and his stupid plans to try and beat me. That was bad, because I didn't I thought flamethrower was slot two. And that should be GG's. Let's go. And that is the any percent portion complete. There is only like three hours left of the run. And the audio desynced massively again. Woohoo. I'm getting sick of this capture card, but I can't afford a new one. Every time I hear the audio stutter, I know the capture card is just desync. <coughs> I like this GMAX Charizard design. Yo. Technically, that's a f kind of a fake gold because we didn't teach Nuzzle, but that's fine. All right, I'm going to go take a quick break. I will be back. You have like two minutes, three minutes to do whatever the fuck you want.
Let's go. Fuck it, dude. Right, we're ready. That, that was my only break in the entire run. Complete. <coughs> only break in the run done. Probably going to piss myself now. Anywho. Get fucking back to it. Okay, I'm using a bit of time because... Okay, cryogonal. Gotta catch cryogonal. Little bit. Cryogonal now. Catch him now. Yeah, I gotta do. I didn't teach him. Fuck. Right, let's quickly um, lose even more time trying to catch. Fucking, you know. Yeah, we're gonna lose so much time here. I'm not even joking, we are going to lose so much time here. Shit menuing, having to pull what's its face out. Then having to now teach a new move. Also not having a... Wait, can I buy a quick ball? Wait, I need to check this shop. Buy quick ball. Nope. 
Okay, losing more time. Everything is coming crashing down. I swear I've done this category before. Cryogonal, cryogonal, cryogonal. No, he despawned. Dude, cryogonal! There! Come here, cryogonal. Okay, we're gonna have to do this nuzzle super fang shit. Fuck! The fact that one, I have to waste timer balls, and two, I only have 90. Remember that. I only have 90 uh, timer balls. So this could go very south very, very quickly. Unsurprising if we lose like a minute here. We have two, three minutes to beat Calyrex.
Yeah, I'm losing so much time here. Fucking hell, dude. Cool, I've seen this like 7,000 times. I don't care. Like, I'm sorry, but I really just don't care. Fuck off! Move! Shift! Yeah, this is so much time down the fucking drain. So much, so much time gone. It's going to be a minute before we even start the fight, and they're probably another 30 seconds. Fucking move! I don't care! <coughs> this is fucking crazy, man. Okay, can we fight? Can you not try and fucking talk to me? Yeah, come on. Plus 120 going into the fight. Speed up, please. I don't care. I don't care. I'm not eating berries. I don't care. He's only using one move. It doesn't matter. This is plus two. This is plus two. Just bear that in mind. Bear in mind that this is going to be plus two. Okay, speed up. These levels mean fuck all plus 201. Let's compare. Bullshit, man. Fucking bullshit. Okay, do you know what's cool, mate? I don't care. There's four minutes of time save on Reggie Steel here? Wow. Wow, Luigi. Wow, Luigi. Okay, I'm going fucking nuts right now. I'm going Super Saiyan fucking mode in a minute. Pli what was the point in that? Thank you. Wait, that's not everyone. Oh, I didn't buy the carrot off the dude. I need the get go that this was everyone. Oh, do I also need to talk to her? Yeah. I, I also need to talk to her. For some reason. Dude, let me fucking talk to him.
Okay, something I didn't do in PB. Go up to Mayo. I did it in this run, I'm pretty sure, but I didn't do it in PB. So, here we are. I have 90 timer balls compared to the usual, like, 120, 150, because I bought too many forest stores. So, using excessive amount of balls could be more detrimental than just it taking a long time. Could also mean that we have to do some resets for balls. Which I don't know about you guys, but I quite frankly don't want to have to do. I do want to check it out. Fun fact, apparently I've been playing this game for less than five hours. Whoa, whoa. Defense. <sighs> Heavy slam does do a lot of damage. Please be paralyzed. It is not paralyzed. It wasn't paralyzed, but that's not bad. Heavy slam. Scary. This is why we came prepared with fucking s seven extra full resource. Can he get paralyzed, please? Please? Paralyze? It is paralyzed. Okay, it's in the red. And I lived on three. Fair enough. <coughs> okay, we're going to use one more forest door and then time of all time. Charge beam. Woohoo. Yeah, use that move more. Use that move a bit more often, please. Because that could work quite well, actually. Like, I would like it to do that more often. Fuck yes! Fuck yes! Fuck yes! Let's go! <coughs> Let's go. When you healed the Dene? Uh, we can use potions for that. Um, yeah. Yeah. Oh, fuck yeah, dude.
I do this just in case I don't get the blow point. I know I lose like probably a minute to just saving here, but I think it's a hundred percent worth it. Just in case something goes wrong and you don't want to have to reset so fucking far away. Please, thank you. Paralyze. Let me switch to Cryogonal with KO. I don't think I've ever swapped to Cryogonal. I always swap to Suicune, yeah, I'm pretty sure. <coughs> don't. Stop using Ice Beam, mate. What are you doing? Sado. How has it not been paralyzed once? I avoided that, but how has it not been paralyzed once? Thank you. <laughs> Fuck, dude. Almost two first balls then. Fuck. That's kind of annoying. That would have been really, really cool, though. That would have been cool if I had two first balls. That would be fucking mental. I, I would be laughing my ass off if I had two first balls right there. Yeah, dead. Okay, we're losing time. We have a minute 23 until... A minute 23 until we start to lose time over PB. <coughs> Come on, this is scary, man. I have to start losing time to PB and it's scary. No, please. Please. <laughs> please. Please. Come on. 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 Yes! Fuck yes, dude. Fuck yes. Thank fuck for that. Yeah, I'll take that, you know.
I'll take that like one minute gold, five minute time saved, twenty three seconds saved. I lost a shit ton of time on gold, but I'll take it. I'm assuming now it's report back to Calyrex. Seven minutes to play around with you. Seven minutes off BPT to play around with in the rest of the run. By the way, my BPT is almost 30 minutes faster than my PB. No, my BPT, my sob. Getting into the deep shit now. There's stuff that's like completely out of my control that I've spent the whole day doing for it to potentially lead to something big or potentially crumble and fall and make me cry. One of the two. We'll see. We'll see which one this cold is. Oh, spoopy, spoopy. Bit like Spectra, scary.
Fuck off, man. That was the worst potential way to make the H ever. I literally missed two circles on the floor. This My best is exactly 10 minutes. That's a shock. It's quite cool, exactly 10 minutes, but that's a shock. One, two, it's not been paralyzed yet. Fuck. Dude, it has not been paralyzed yet. It's still yet to be paralyzed. What is this, like turn five? Hello? <laughs> uh, question. Does paralysis exist um, for Regirock? Because I paralyzed it and it hasn't been paralyzed yet. Thank you. No, do not fight it. Do not fucking hit it. Dude! You've been paralyzed once in like nine turns. <coughs> once in nine turns has this thing been paralyzed. Oh my fucking god. What is this luck? What is this luck? I'm running out of balls. We got two catches left to do after this, and I'm running out of balls. Three catches, sorry. A three catches after this. What the fuck? Dude, what is... Okay, De at least Dedene is avoiding the attacks. What in the fucking shit is this? What in the fucking shit is this luck with paralysis for? That is such bad paralysis luck. That was shit paralysis luck. You know what? We pe we we got a gold, but what was that paralysis luck, man? Okay. <coughs> oh wait, no. Right, we forest ore. Uh, we el nope. We elixir. <coughs> was absolutely fucking shocking. No, nope. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. It's gonna happen. Fuck off. You ain't getting me. My time to shine.
I don't think. I think Reggie Drago has one move to hit Dedene, as far as I'm aware. As far as I'm aware, he has one move to hit Dedene. One. Hence, hence why no X items are used. <coughs> I'm pretty sure it's only one move. That's not an attacking move. I wonder if we'll see it. Yes. Yes, we will. Immediately as I say, I wonder if we'll see it. Immediately after I say wonderful see it, we see it. <coughs> I'm starting to... I'm a bit confused why this segment is seven minutes and I enter it in two and a half. Bit confused, not gonna lie. Because I thought my gold first bold Reggie Drago. So I'm a bit, bit confused. Confusy woozed. Maybe it didn't. Because that was three minutes. Um, I don't fucking know. And here's the kicker. Um, the next Pokemon, Articuno, has so much fucking time save. Come on. Okay, Spectre dead. Twenty minutes this segment is, and all it is is talking to Calyrex, talking to the mayor for a tiny bit. Like that should should take like five minutes to activate. I also never thought about um changing the date of time because I don't do that in my PB. Hurts. 
I think from now on, I'm going to write in my splits how many balls each Pokemon took. Like how um, people in Let's Go um, put how many catches they had. <coughs> I might add that to my splits after this run. I'll do like PB to record. So then I can at least keep track and not be guessing, oh, it took this many balls. Yeah, I'll meet you up there after I just catch this one Pokemon. Let me just, you know, get my life in order with catching other things that are more important than whatever you're trying to catch. Actually, Spectre is quite important because that's... <coughs> Spectre is kind of how you finish the rest of the game. So I kind of need Spectre. Can't be that good because I already whooped his ass once. A legendary tree of a legendary three that I'm gonna catch. One of them not for a few hours, but I'm still going to catch him. I'm hoping that this one's quite fucking easy. It's just fucking annoying. Oh, no! I 
I'm gonna make sure I gotta keep up with it. There it is. Alright, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get over there. I'm gonna save, change the date of time. Fuck off! No, don't do this to me. 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 I swear, if this Articuno spawn is fucked over by a bear tick, I'm gonna scream. If this one bear tick just lasts me like 10 minutes, I'm gonna cry. Okay, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Um, change the time to 10. What is it? One. I'll change it to like. That one, isn't it? It was that one. Now we save. Hang on, wait, who's in front? Aha! That's where I fucked up, because... Wait, switch so your turn just to the lead. Yeah, it doesn't tell me to swap him back. Yeah, we're just going to quickly heal. Now we want X spit off. Freezing glare is scary. Shit, dude, psycho cut? No! Um, I mean danger. <coughs> Aha! Fuck you! No! <laughs> Shit, dude, low batcher. Okay, I can do it with some just throwing. I'll do it with some throwing shit. But with by with some wire. Can't find the wire that I use. Can't find the wire. I found a wire. It's not the wire, but it'll have to do. That's why I will have to do. 
I don't know where the other one went. This game is fun! <coughs> 21 ahead. For once, Articuno goes right. He's right at the fork. After the snow path, go right at the fork. That's what I was reading. <coughs> so go right. Go right. Left when it goes up. Ha, I didn't fuck it up. And up the stairs we go. Right, so now we gotta save a bike boost. Oh, I'm so happy that Articuno finally went right. Wasn't the perfect amount of balls, but you know what? I'll take it. Like I will I will take that. That was fucking good enough for me. Seven minutes. <coughs> we are now... Like, we are so far ahead. There is only one more major RNG section that can really screw us over. This is the run I've been looking for. I need to sort these headphones out. There we go. This is that one run that I've been looking for for so long. And it all started with the duo vector. The duo vector caused this run to happen. <coughs> the duo vector, because it was so bad and still PB'd, it caused this run to happen. Which caused me to get a sob that is almost a 729x. Thank fuck that I didn't submit that run yesterday. Like, I don't even know what to say. The duo factor happened all of a sudden and has changed a lot. I done my longest speedrun, I've got my first Pokemon world record, my first multi-Pokemon world record, and has convinced me to do another GST.
And here we use my first Master Ball. Go alive. Oh shit. Paralition? No, it's 64. <coughs> Let's fucking go. This is so like crazy man okay I lost one second I lost one second of gold gained 28 more BPT is a 742 Holy shit, 742 BPT. Who could have known? Okay, first we want to heal everyone. Uh, we're going to revive... <coughs> revive, full restore. Uh, Alexa did any if needed. Um, I don't think so. We're going to check, though. No. Move Calyrex to slot 3, Eternatus to slot 2. Deposit Regice and Reg uh, an Articuno, even though it should be three different Regis. Come on. Um. Taxi to Wildarian Lotus Turk. And then jump on and ready to just. I fucking. I hit that. I hit. That. I don't even. Nope. I hit that, but whatever. I guarantee to you that I hit that, but like. I tried to capture it, but no. Okay, chasing Articuno we go, because, no, Articuno, Zapdos, because apparently I didn't fucking run into it. I did, but, like, uh, clearly that's not what the game thinks. Come on. Okay, that lost a shit ton of time. <coughs> okay, you thunderous kick. That did half. Fuck. Nuzzle. Alright, we're gonna... This is gonna be... This is the last Pokemon to catch in the run. Don't do a lot, don't do a lot. What are you doing? Yeah, I kind of just have to go Super Fang here, I think. It's going to not kill me. If it could get power or use focus energy this turn, I would be much appreciated. Thank fuck for you. If it could get paralyzed or use focus energy. That's okay. Calyrex switch in. We got it to where we wanted to, so. The only thing we want to do is not use this fucking Master Ball. Okay, we didn't waste the Master Ball. That's a good thing. We just didn't waste the Master Ball, which is phenomenal because we don't like wasting Master Balls. Fuck you! <laughs> Fuck you, mate. Could have just saved me another seven minutes. But that's okay, because we don't mind. 
Fuck, dude. Oh, that was a crit. <coughs> Come on, dude. You could, you could cause some brilliant things to happen. Don't be an asshole. Don't be an asshole. You could cause this run to be off the charts, like, brilliant. If you just don't be an asshole. Please, just don't be an asshole. Please don't be an asshole. Like, if even if you just saved me a few more minutes. Or even just didn't lose me any time. Like, I would be happy with that. I'd be happy if you just didn't lose me any more time. Like... I don't think you realize how grateful I would be. Thank fuck for that. Go kill me. <laughs> this run is goated. <laughs> Literally all phenomenal catches. <laughs> I said go kill yourself. There is a chance that this could PB by 30 minutes. Oh, yes, I do need to heal. Holy fuck, dude. <coughs> dude, literally, as one, a nerve, a nerve. Could not be any slower. Go! This is going to be a great... This could could be a great run. Move! That's it. That is it. That is the Slumbering World. One encounter. Fuck yeah, boy. <coughs> this is the run I've been waiting for. All encounters were solid. Like, there wasn't anyone that really stood out costing me a fuck ton of time. Wait, what? Oh. Like, it was kind of just... It was, it was just good. All, all around, just good. All around were those catches good. Right, time to put a tank ping. G. <coughs> Gotta get me riled up right now, haven't you? Game is really doing this to me now. Now of all places.
could not be like just it's just I I I can't put a finger on it right now. I've grinded quite a while for this. Or it feels like quite a fucking while. <coughs> right, off we go. Time to start the dreaded fucking post game that takes about an hour to beat. It'll take a less than an hour, actually. It'll take... Probably, like, 56 minutes. <clears throat> My throat is dying right now. This is the run to do it, I think. I quite literally have to lose 22 minutes. I have to somehow get 22 minutes of time loss to throw this. Which, knowing it, I will 100% do. is no I'm going to cry I don't even know what to think dude I kind of just have to do it by the way this could very 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 easily like lower the time for the duo effect of. <coughs> like, if I could recreate this, kind of. This could be a nuts duo effect of time. Whatever goals I said to Gal earlier. One of them's smashed, potentially. I'm not going to get my hopes up yet. I mean, I technically can, because there's no RNG catches left. There's one that could be broken. If I can, if I can match gold and somehow get a five minutes worth of gold, the other one could also be broken in the same run. If I can get like five minutes worth of gold, it would take my BPT down to a 729. And I could have my summer best be fast and teapot. Yeah. But like, every catch went well. <laughs> like, look, look at the, the... I have very goofy hair, but like, that's the least of my concern right now. I'm on a wild run right now. Being plus, like, being plus the whole run for the past, like, two hours has paid off. Oh, those twins, yeah. I'm surprised his hair can stay up like that. How much hair gel do you think he uses? Yeah, minus 30. 15 minutes alone to Zapdos and Articuno. Articuno, I had to chase after Articuno, even though my bike wheel went through Articuno, uh, Zapdo, sorry. But everything went perfect. I had, all the Regis were between ball one and five. Articuno was a bit more than five. 
Zapdos was about five. Um, the only one left now is Zamazenta that has an increased catch rate, so it's not like those ones. <coughs> Which I don't think I can lose 22 minutes throughout the rest of the run. I don't think 22 minutes is going to happen. But I'm on a crazy run right now. Like, stupid luck. Like, I'm gonna explode. <laughs> I doubt we can get five minutes of gold to reach the BPT of um, 7.29, but if it happens, that would also be really, really cool. It's like, I don't know, I'm feeling a lot of emotions. <laughs> Sounds a bit weird, but like, it's true. How long have I had this 8.08? A month? I get like one PB a month. It's been that month. I think it's been a month, yeah. The twenty seventh of April, I got my PB. Twenty seventh of April was when I got my PB. It is now the second of June. <laughs> Just coming off of a duo pack, though. Honestly, I don't even care about what pace this is for on leaderboard terms. Like, I really don't even care about that. I think it's just barely top 10. No, he's Dynamaxing. Of course he is. Of course he's Dynamaxing. We didn't kill, so now he's Dynamaxing, basically. So that costs me 15 seconds to him Dynamaxing. Yeah, we just lost way too much time to him Dynamaxing. Because fucking hop. Because <coughs> he thinks he's cool Dynamaxing. If we don't kill Gyarados, he'll Dynamax on Gyarados. He'll think he's cool and Dynamax on Gyarados. He'll say, oh, I'm helping. When realistically, he's setting him else, himself up for more failure. Basically, for this next hour or so, I have to sweat. To not like drop this 30 minutes because I would love to PB by th exactly 30 minutes. Um, Articuno saved seven minutes because I killed it three times in PB. Because I didn't change the date of time. Um, Zapdos took like what well, felt like 30, 40 balls in PB. And it took like s 5 or 6 in this run. Which saved me 9 minutes. And then everything else took a reasonable amount of balls to catch. Nothing was exceedingly like, oh fuck, this thing is taking forever. Everything was at a good steady amount. I started with 90 balls and I've still got like 60 something, which never happens. Everything, all the catches just went well. And I lost two minutes at the start of just after beating Leon. 
I lost two minutes to encounter and cryogonal, forgetting that I don't have Nuzzle. Going back, teaching Nuzzle, trying to find another cryogonal, and realizing I don't have a quick ball. Which lost me two minutes. That happened, and yet I'm still minus 30. And also, this run has just been... This run has been good all throughout. I was plus 2 at the end of... What's it called? Suicune, but that's fine. Because PB was plus 5. So, I'm like, completely... Complete, like, in shock, kind of. Of how well this run has gone, because I haven't royally messed up anywhere. Okay, well, he's Dynamaxing for sure, because we're not going to kill. So, ready? Look. He's... That Cinderace will be Dynamaxed in a minute. Don't know why. This thing is quad weak to Gyarados. Firefighting. It's a firefighting versus a water ground. Uh, water flying. Quad weak, yeah, he still thinks it's a good time to Dynamax. Or oh, pure fire. Well, again, water versus fucking fire. I'm thinking of M Boys, water, not water, fire fighting. So now I'm losing more time to the fact that he's a retard and thinks it's a good time to Dynamax. I've lost 30 seconds over him thinking it's a good time to Dynamax. When he's probably, he's literally one tap to anything. No, 21. This is where I buy 21 full restores. Not, um, fucking earlier where I bought 21 instead of 14. No, fuck up. Calyrex. Slot three. No, oh, okay. Got one more with Eternatus before then we hard switched Calyrex for the foreseeable future. be scary. If we can just do this well, Hop won't Dynamax. Again, this is not the time to Dynamax with Fire on Fire. One hit Torkoal, Fire on Fire, not a good time to Dynamax. See, what's that? What was the point in that? Uh, Dynamax Cannon does more, I believe. One HP. That was definitely intended. <coughs> Why is he Dynamaxing? He's in the red. But I believe it's the Dy uh, Dynamax Cannon does more damage. Also, I would then have to swap my lead 
I'd have to swap my lead from Eternatus to Suicune and then after from Suicune to Calyrex. When it would take the same amount of turns anyway. It's like 10 seconds of swapping. 10-ish seconds of swapping my Pokemon for it to do basically nothing. I missed the door. They just got called weirdos and now they're confused why. I don't think there's a need to, like... Like, I don't know about you. I, I, I don't know. I don't know why. Is it because they're wearing blue and red, maybe? I think it's because they're wearing blue and red myself. Fuck. That doesn't happen very often. <laughs> I'm, I'm a bit confused. What? Why am I in the red? Usually I'm in the green. I just realized that today was two months ago that I got Imaginators sub 2. Exactly today. If you want to be pedantic, it's in like four hours from now. Like we're half an hour ahead is still crazy to me. I was expecting like seven or eight minutes, not not thirty. It does kind of annoy me though that I played like I thought I played really really well for that eight oh eight. And in one run, it's been put to shame. Because <laughs> now I'm being proved that my run was absolute shit. Hello. 
No. I'm not going there. Waste of time. Okay, now we permanently switch to Afro Barrage here. Wait, what time is it? Almost four. Now I don't have to worry about Hop thinking it's funny to fucking Dynamax. No! Well, I've lost my 30 minute lead, it's now Come on. Fuck's sake. It takes like 200 fucking years to even start the fight. Ah, fuck you.
bash my knee on my desk. No, nope. mm, okay. It has to have happened one time. Oh, is there four Dynamax? I just realized you said let everyone let's split up and take down a Pokemon. Is there four Dynamax Pokemon in the stadium? <coughs> is that what they mean when they say we all need to split up and take one? Not we all need to split up and take one gym. That would make sense. Yeah, dude, I lost all my time save again. I don't think I need to heal. Well, let's quickly check, right? No.
By the way, anyone wondering uh, if we're raiding anyone after this? Probably going to be raiding Etiquette. Because I think he's the only one doing like PSR ones. He's doing Let's Go Pikachu runs. I don't know whether this is practice for Tawny or not. But... <coughs> this is probably practice for his... Let's go, Tawny. I don't know if he's doing his match anytime soon. Or it's probably for sub 3, to be honest. We've got about 45 minutes left of this run, which is pretty funny to say because usually I'd say there's an hour and 20 minutes left of this run. But no, there's about 45 minutes. <coughs> it's so fun to say that there's like so little time left. We're at this point, and instead of being like seven hours and like almost 20 minutes in, we're six hours and 47 minutes in. It's so cool. It's, it's mental to think about how far in we are and how like low the timer is. I like to think that I'm gaming right now, yeah. There is one catch left of the run, which is Amazenta with a boosted uh, catch rate. Let's just not goof. Yeah, I'm losing time here. I don't know. I, I know why. I need to remember to swap to Dedene. Because Dedene will be our Lord and Savior who catches this foul beast. We're not Master Balling, because obviously the increased catch rate. Uh, we're going to be Master Balling Moltres instead. Crunch. Scary. Less scary because it was a crit. Huh? 
Yeah, if you could just keep using iron defense, that'd be great. <coughs> I said iron defense, but okay. No, fuck, dude, fuck, fuck. Come on. Mm. Scary. Please. I don't mash B. Sometimes I hold A because I forget to let go, or sometimes I just don't press anything. That time I didn't press anything. LFG! <coughs> we got Hop 10, the Max Honey side quest, and then the GST, and then it is done. We might, well, we're not might. We will be finishing the, D, uh, the post game in under seven hours. World record is still not finished. Come on. <coughs> Calyrex. Post trick. Ah, uh, down. Post trick. We don't have to... We don't have to go through because we could just talk to Sonya. She will let us go. And this final fight, what do we do? We spam Psychic. Let's go. Bro can speak Zacian language. He can speak Zacian. Who knew that? He's just threw... He just punched Zacian. Like, what can I say? And then a Pokeball magically appears. First of all, he can speak Zacian. Then he punches it in the face. And then it's in a ball. And his hand is moving whilst the Pokeball isn't. Let's go. <coughs> Psychic spam. Yeah, I'm not going to. I'm going to... Actually, I'm not even going to hold a button, let alone hold anything back. I'm just going to shove it on turbo and be done with the fight. You're not even going to hit me.
This is the most boring fucking fight ever. There's like nothing interesting happening in this fight. Gonna do it. Right, go one more mon. Yeah. <coughs> one more mon, and then we have just the Isle of Armor left. Just Zacian. I died. How the fuck did that happen, can I ask? <laughs> I just I just died. Well, we're losing time. I just I just died. <laughs> It would have been nicer if you killed me, but... Right, well, we're losing significant time now. This thing is faster than me. That's probably why. Really? At the last fucking one? The last mon of this, uh, of this fight gets me below 30 minutes ahead. Like, what the fuck, man? I'm not meant to use psychic. Hey, that's not psychic. That's fucking. Oh my god. This run's going to shit. No, 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 no. Dude, Zacian is way too, way too strong. We have a problem. I'm losing time drastically. <laughs> I'm quickly losing time. Hydra. Hit the Hydro. Hit the Hydro, please. Thank you. It's not dead, though. Alright, we're going to be plus two healed! Wow, did I just lose? Wow. Bullcrap. Bullcrap, man. Did I lose sub seven... I lost sub seven post game to some random bullcrap. I just max revived the wrong mon. Wow. That's how it's going to be. I'm plus two right now. Wow. I see. I see how it is. I see how it is. Yeah, fuck over the sub-7 post-game. Make me plus two and a half. Because this thing dies to crunch. Wow. Bullcrap. Fucking bullcrap. Don't make me lose this fight. That is shit, man. That is sad. I'm gonna about to lose three minutes on the final fight of this whole this whole section. Wow. That is dumb. Wow. Three minutes. Wow. Because somehow Zacian killed Calyrex, proceeded to kill everything, and then healed when it was one tap. That is bullcrap. 320 I just lost. Somehow Zacian killed. 
somehow Zacian killed Calyrex. And then I could not get any damage off. That was going so well. I was... And now my mood has been killed to losing th over three minutes. The whole run has been so decent. Losing not even that much time. Probably a maximum of 20 seconds per split. And then that happens. <coughs> Fucking bullshit. Fun fact, I could have caught Moltres by now. That is so... That is so stupid. So stupid. So stupid, it is unbelievable. Great, and I wasted my bike boost. Perfect. That is unfucking believable. Either my Calyrex had shit speed or shit defense. It was one of the two. I'm going to guess shit speed because I'm guessing I should have outsped. There he is. And I ran into a Baneri. <laughs> Ooh, something's going to go out the window in a minute. You know what? I'll be fine if this can just... I don't even know, man. <coughs> Who's ready to watch me have a recording of me jumping out a window? That is the last catch that I'm fucking doing. I'm not doing any more catching in this game. Like, just... No. <laughs> by the way, we made it to the final hour barrier that was rudely interrupted by losing three minutes. Still big PB, 100%. When it PBs, because at this point, I'm not sure I'm gonna PB. <laughs> B 
But this is like the one run that I've been waiting for. I don't know why I've played better so far. It might be because I'm... I don't get tired of doing runs this length anymore. Personally, I think I was due. I've wasted... I, I wouldn't say wasted. I've finished three runs. That's eight hours apiece. Or nine hours, eight and a half hours, and then eight hours. Plus a nine one-hour attempts. Plus a few that have made it to the two-hour mark. That's a lot. <coughs> that is a lot of hours. It's a lot of hours and a lot of resets that really just didn't seem necessary. Did I lose Lilligan? Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me right now? Are you actually kidding me right now? I have to walk and I walked and I still lost Lilligan. Even more time loss. Are you kidding me right now? Are you... I'm losing my mind. It should be fine though. Shouldn't lose me too much time. Can something in this end game go right, please? It's funny to think that my PB still has an hour left to go. It's also funny to think that there's like 20 minutes of time save isn't from catches because most of them got golds if not lost two seconds so there's 20 minutes of time save that isn't the catches but we're getting to a point now where any single like pb is precious because those catches were good and it's, i don't have any more time save from them so if any of them go bad and i lose a significant amount of time that's a reset Five and a half hours in. And it will happen a lot more than, than you'd think. Yeah. It will happen a lot due to the fact that those catches are not high catch rates. 
I got lucky with catches and execution was not too great. <coughs> ah, fuck. I need to do something. Which is why I'm going to put the category to rest for now and work on Mochi. Because I don't want to... Oh, fuck. Everyone's dead. Calyrex, Eternatus, Zamazenta, and they're all dead because of Hop. <laughs> Hop's the reason why I'm losing time again. That's not the right Pokemon. Right. Give the choice specs to Eternatus. Eternatus. Nope. Eternatus. Lead. Deposit extra mons. <coughs> right. Off we go. The last thing before mustard. Oh, beehive. It's supposed to be a massive tree trunk. Speed rose. Oh shit. I might actually be able to do this with just Tinnitus. I am. No. Wait. I was almost able to do. Oh. He got rid of his speed. No, he's so faster. <coughs> that was some big time saving coming, and then I lost it. It still didn't kill. What? Right, now I'm losing even more time. Because <laughs> apparently it didn't kill with Behemoth Bash. Dude, now it crits. It crits when I don't need it to, so it loses time, but it doesn't crit when I need it to. I'm telling you, everything's losing me time in this last section. Everything. Mustard fight, one more mustard fight.
Come on, mustard. I don't need this dynamaxing bullshit. I'm yet to dynamax in the entire game. Did I really just hear it? Oh, great. Crit. He's gonna do a speech. Yep. I'm losing time to crits now. I'm losing time everywhere in this last hour. Everywhere. <laughs> Literally everywhere. I lost time to losing Lilligan. I lost three minutes to hop. I'm losing time on Mustard now because I crit. I'm losing time to the fact that I have to do two behemoth bashes and that Eternit has died. I'm losing time because I ran into a Baneri on Moltres. Literally. And I just used Psychic on Cor Corviknight. Fuck me, dude. Everything is losing me time. Everything I bet now is a range. Yeah, 1 HP. He lived on 1 HP. Remember that. <laughs> I bet you now I don't kill Kamo'o, Lycanroc, or Urshifu. I bet I don't kill any of them. I'm making so many stupid mistakes, it's unreal. And RNG fucking me over. thing is, is the joke's on them. I don't have enough Astral Barrages. I was going to say joke's on them, sub 8 still on the table. And then I look, and I don't have enough Astral Barrages for the Airship. <laughs> I'm going to fucking lose it. Oh... What is this, man? Thing is, is that this can this can still PB. <laughs> this can still beat PB. Um, I think as long as Ishifu doesn't kill me, and yeah, just as long as Ishifu doesn't kill me, because I don't have any more possible good revives. Of course it fucking does. Of course it does. Of course. Uh, I mean this segment in specific. But of course... Everything's going to shit by here. Now I have to switch into Zamazenta. Go into Zamazenta. Revive Calyrex. Waste more time. Bloody bloody blah. Max knuckle. Bloody bloody blah. I, I live. You know what? Now nah, you know. What? No, do we? No. We don't because I kill him anyway with Calyrex. This is going to be a 7 4x, not a 7 3x now. This whole run's going to be a 7 3x. A 4x, sorry. That is so dumb. I've lost so much time everywhere at the end. I don't think the light screen would have mattered. Everywhere I've lost time since... It fucking killed me again. I lost the fight. I have to redo that whole fight. That's four minutes. That's four minutes down the drain. That's a total of five minutes down. 
I have to redo this entire fight. Literally, I have lost time save everywhere. Have I or have I not lost everywhere? <laughs> three minutes on hop 10. Four minutes, five minutes actually on mustard three. This is a shit show. Could, it just could not go right. I tell you, this game hates me. Every run up until this point has had shit zapped and shit out of Kuna. The one run where everything goes right, I have shit hop 10, shit rest of Isle of Armor. It's so horrible everywhere. Literally nothing has gone right. There is at no point can this run actually go right. I am so sick of this run, it is unbelievable. I've gone from happy that I've actually been plus 30, or minus 30 rather, to now pissed off that I'm about to be, that I've lost 15 minutes in the past hour. And that once again, I've played this game, done this run, and something has gone wrong. I also died because one, I didn't, I don't even know why I ran out of Astro Barrage. I haven't used Calyrex. Meaning I wouldn't have won anyway, even if I had used the right move. Because I would have been one down on the Komo anyway. Or the Haxor, sorry. Just one way to ruin a really good run. And I get the text again because I crit him again. Which is even more time loss. I'm going to be even more than plus five, by the way. There you go, plus five. For what split was meant to have minus one point uh, 120 time save has plus five.
You cannot make this shit up. Oh, let's finish this run out.
It's the rest of these fights. I'm pretty sure it's just my master barrage. Literally no setup required. Game these things one last time. Wait, what? Why? Huh? What? Oh, no. No, I meant to kill Dreadnought with Flapple. Why is this a three turns? Why is this a four turn fight? Huh? More time loss, by the way. More time loss because for some reason that was a four turn fight.
Final fight of the run. Big PB time. Yeah, I'm just not. I'm really angry at the fact that Hop 10 and beyond, everything that could go wrong, quite literally did go wrong. Including that I lost 10 minutes in two fights. Which cost the 3x by a considerable amount. I don't know what that is, unfortunately. I don't know whether this game hates me or like I did something to it <coughs> because because like Yeah, quite literally. Apart from the catches, everything that could go wrong did go wrong. Including, I had Mustard's crit text twice because I crit him twice. Even just small things like that went wrong. At least this should still be a uh, 744. However, I'm still playing within 20 minutes of my sob. <coughs> my sob is still 20 minutes slower. Or uh, faster, sorry. The whole point was to close the gap between my PB and my sob. And if anything, I've made it further apart. My sob right now is 40 minutes faster than this run. Uh, than my PB. And I've only probably gathered it in by like 2 minutes. Wait, what the fuck? Did I mess up? No G- wait, what? No G-Max? The fuck? Huh? 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 What? No- no G-Max? I'm sorry, why? Wait, what? I'm so g Was that you? No. Am I stupid? I s- what? Oh, I'm definitely stupid. Fucking hell, I'm losing my mind. Right. We did it. Sub 8. Everything that could go wrong from Hop 10 and onwards did go wrong. I'm gonna put it out there. <laughs> I'm not doing this again. I'm. You cannot make me. The catches went correct. You cannot make me do this again. Because... <laughs> I don't really care about leaderboards, but let's check. Where 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 are we on the boards?
<laughs> I am losing my fucking mind at the minute. 7.44 puts us... 11th. Not even top 10 anymore. <laughs> Thanks to Mustard, we lost top 10. But whatever. Uh, I'm going to be raiding etiquette 